I'd like to highlight two members of the Hell Plus Forum this week. One is Brian Murphy. Brian Murphy is from Chicago, Illinois, and I believe he resides there currently. He was one of the members that ran for office in his district and has been a member of the Hell Plus Forum since 2011. Are you guys familiar with who Brian Murphy is in the forum? You two are pretty active in the forum. Yeah, I guess yeah. he uh, he's the guy who went to vote with Hell Plus shirt on. Yeah, the Hell Plus shirt. Yeah. And on the this this Hell Plus shirt and what Keith has on is also a Hell Plus shirt. So if you would like a Hell Plus shirt, please check out the store on hellcross.com, which is h e l c r o s s dot com. Hi guys. Hello. So who's the other guy? The other guy that I want to highlight this week is Raphael Papa. Raphael is from Jacksonville, Florida. Believe he currently resides in Jacksonville, Florida. He too has been a member of the Hell Plus Forum since 2011. Do you guys know who Raphael Papa is? I no, not really. Yes, you do. I do. Yeah, he's the Ron Paul fan. Oh, yeah, those guys all kind of bleed together. Yeah, <laughs> I, know. I think I know who you're talking about. He's a good guy. Um, he's just a huge Ron Paul fan. Nothing wrong with being a huge Ron Paul fan. Well, I mean, Ron Paul is also the kind of guy that you wouldn't mind having a beer with, too. So. No, I wouldn't want to have a beer with Ron Paul. Why not? He's a racist. Well, minus that. <laughs> Sorry, but I read his newsletter. <laughs> I, don't know. I, I don't. I don't uh, quite agree with the entire libertarian philosophy either. So why not? Just because it makes sense until you think about it for about ten seconds. Yeah. <laughs> and you're like, wait a minute, no, because people don't act like that in the real world. No. Like ending the FDA, EPA, like. So they wouldn't like our short film that we did, libertarian FDA. No. No. That was the whole point of Libertarian FDA. Yeah. It was the point out that we actually need the FDA. Their, their whole philosophy is, well, you can just sue the drug companies. It's like they already get sued all the time. Yeah. But they make so much money, they don't give a shit. Class action lawsuit, you sue them for $100 million. Well, they usually they, they, they make settle them. out of court. They, they pay a huge amount of money to the plaintiffs. And then they make them sign a confidentiality agreement. So that they can continue to sell the drug that kills people or continue the behavior that kills people and not no, worry about it. Yeah. Why, why? It's like, oh, well, you know, we're making more money than we're paying out in settlements. So let's keep doing it. Yeah. Car companies do this shit too. So, yeah. All companies, really. So, yeah. So, they're, they're, if anything, the FDA needs to be, needs to have more teeth and it needs to be run by people who aren't in the industries that they're trying to regulate. That, that would be nice.